the course of this country. He fundamentally thinks that the way to, say, solve our jobs crisis in this country is to either make private enterprise dependent on government or go and run and just create more government jobs or create a new welfare program. He's not interested in creating an economy where we have standalone, independent, free enterprise. Two let's, that were rejected. All right, go ahead, Lucy. So what's the problem? Let's put the that problem into let's, is let's, downstream. Let's put that into perspective. The, the FDA loves to talk about its 99% approval rating, but let's just talk about cancer. Half a million Americans get diagnosed with cancer every year, and 40% of them try to get into clinical trials. That's about 200,000 people. Uh, the vast majority of them are not allowed in. Does anyone really think that even just focusing on cancer, that only a thousand of them try to pursue it? No, they well, are the locked out of the system. The FDA that's not, that's locks not them out the of every state. Let, this and, let, and, let, let and respond. That's what ends up happening, I just was with advisory board. So the religious freedom win, that's important, but right now people are worried about access to birth control. Let's flash forward, you know, several years when people are worried about access to a triple bypass surgery, some of the medical care that we truly need that we're going to be... ...that the Obama administration is going to use. So bankruptcy is kind of a dirty word, but it shouldn't be. It's just cities, a city coming toward its creditors, in this case, the unions and the pension systems, and saying, hey, look, this is what we've got in the honeypot. Can we work something out? And I'm thinking like heroin. I mean, if I'm in pain, I want multiple. I mean, forgive me for being crass here, but, you know, I want it. Yeah. Well, that's well, not. Well, I get it. <laughs> no, I mean, seriously. Well, that's the, her the heroin you can't get through the FDA or a pharmaceutical company. But these other drugs, right now we have this problem that it takes such a long time to get these drugs to market. Over a billion dollars and over a decade. But very quickly we know if a drug is safe or not after about two years. The patients we're talking about, they've exhausted all conventional options. Oh. And they, they just want to have the right to try. Okay. So bureaucrats protecting their turf. Well, sure. I mean, the FDA is the most popular federal agency in the country. And they're very worried about people f fearing that they're taking a drug that's unsafe. But we're not talking about someone having an elective procedure here. We're talking about people who, for whom his death is otherwise certain. I think that drug companies are going to go forward in states like Colorado, in Louisiana, where it was passed yesterday, yes. uh, and, and give patients the access they need. And I know some are already making plans to. So did we have video of him riding a giraffe? I don't think we did. I haven't seen it, but I, I would it. love to see it. Well, what, 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 a 